of white nationalist beliefs, of which there are in this country, unfortunately, do you believe they should be serving in the military? Uh, you got to define that first. What is a white nationalist? Someone who propagates Nazism, someone who doesn't believe that black and brown you people are equal. You think white nationalist is a, is, a, is a Nazi? Well, that is one of their beliefs. Well, I, I don't look at it like that. I, How do you look at it? I look at a white nationalist as a, as a, a Trump Republican. That's what we're called all the time. A mega person. That's what do I'm you just, agree that, with that, that well, assumption? Yeah, I agree that we should not be characterizing Trump supporters as white nationalists. That was Alabama Senator Tommy Tuberville this afternoon speaking to NBC Capitol Hill reporter Julie Serka. And she was trying to get clarification from him regarding the defense he gave on Alabama Public Radio for single-handedly blocking military promotions in the Senate. Here is what he initially told NPR affiliate WBHM. We are losing in the military so fast our readiness in terms of recruitment. And why? I can tell you why. Because the Democrats are attacking our military, saying we need to get out the white extremists, the white nationalists, people that don't don't believe in, in our agenda as as uh, in Joe Biden's agenda, uh, they are destroying it. Uh, this year, we will not reach any recruiting goals in the military. So if we want to talk about looking weak, that's where we're going to look weak. We cannot start putting rules in there for one type, one group, and, and make different factions in the military because that is the most important uh, institution in the United States of America and our allies is a strong, hard-nosed, killing machine, which is called our military. You mentioned the Biden administration trying to prevent uh, white nationalists from being in the military. Do you believe they should allow white nationalists in the military? Well, they call them that. I call them Americans. Senator Tub Tuberville has halted all high-level military promotions since early March in protest of DOD's abortion policies. Joining me now is NBC News Capitol Hill correspondent Ali Vitale and NBC News Pentagon correspondent Courtney Kuby. So Ali, can you help us understand what the senator is saying? Does he know what he's saying? Yeah, we've sort of lost the plot here because the part that's more tangible is the way that Tuberville has been blocking these military promotions and nominations. And there has been a lot of talk here on Capitol Hill about this blanket ban and, of course, the national security implications of that, which, of course, court is going to get into and knows so well. Tuberville, for his part, says he's not going to be moving on those kind on those blocks until he sees GOD's policy around covering abortion expenses change. Doesn't sound like that policy is going to change anytime soon. But now here we are in this white nationalist conversation where he's asking reporters in the hallway to both define what a white nationalist is and also seemingly airing a political gripe about the way that some Trump supporters are supposedly talked about. And again, I have to go back to the idea that I think we've lost the original plot.